Welcome to the Parent Sense home screen. Here you can view your baby's dashboard. The circle at the bottom is the overview of your baby's suggested routine. By moving the circle around, you can see what is coming up during the day. To see your baby's suggested routine in more detail, click on the green heart at the bottom of the page. At the top, enter your baby's wake time each morning and the suggested routine will update accordingly. From the suggested routine page, you can toggle to the tracked page to see the feeds and sleeps that you have tracked that day. Back on the home screen, you can see four boxes, sleep, feed, health, and play. By clicking on sleep, you can see an overview of your baby's sleep pattern. You can also view various day and night sleep tips by clicking read more at the top of the page. At the bottom of the page, you can access our articles related to sleep. This is the same on each topic page. Back on the home screen, you may add a sleep by pressing the plus button. You can either log a previous sleep or start recording a current sleep. On the feeding page, you are able to view the suggested routine for your baby's feeding. There is a breast milk and bottle option, depending what your baby is on. From four months, you can start to bring solids into your baby's diet. Just press solids and enter the date that you started. Your solids routine will be added to your main routine as well as your feeding routine. By clicking on our health page, you can see and track your baby's weight. To add a new weight, click update weight and input your baby's weight. If you need to edit a previous weight, click weight history and then you can edit the weight here. At the top, you can also switch to the vaccination page. Click on a vaccination and input the date to record when your baby was vaccinated. Our play page is where you can record different milestones. Just click the milestones here and enter the date on which it was achieved. Back on the home page, you can also purchase books and ebooks, view upcoming and previous notifications, and access the More menu. Here you can change notification settings, units of measurements, and reset your password. You can also view a tour of the app again at any time. In the top right corner, you can update your and your baby's profile, including profile pictures. To add a new baby to the app, go to your profile and click Add another baby. Please note that if the birthday is different to the birth date of the current baby in your app, you will need to purchase an additional subscription. Finally, you can switch between your baby's profiles here. If you have any issues, please do visit our website, parentsense.app, and fill in our contact form. Thank you for watching, and we hope you enjoy our app.